good morning everybody yeah uh, i'm trying to act like i'm woke for y'all but i am truly not i just feel like i look tired anyway this is the start of a new week i don't think i really vlogged last week too much or maybe you know what i think i vlogged um like a what i eat in a day type style um video last week I don't know if it's gonna stay like vlog style or if I'll just chop it up and just show people like the food that I ate. It's just like healthy-ish meal ideas. If anybody's interested in seeing it, that will probably be up before this. But anywho, it is a new week. It's Monday and it's cold. It is 50 degrees right now. I've got my butt warmers on in the car and hold on, there's something in the middle of the street. I don't know what that is. Oh, a box. Um, <clears throat> I'm sorry, y'all know I got allergies and sinus and actually, I only got updated you guys on that last week. I went to see the ENT specialist and I in fact right now have a sinus infection which they think is the culprit for my ear infections. I've had two ear infections this year. I'm too old for that. But anyway, I'm on my way to work as usual. And I was trying to get there on time so I could get coffee because we have a meeting every Monday morning as soon as we get there at 7.30 and it's, it's 7.19. So I have to wait till after the meeting to go get some coffee. But I did pack my lunch. I'll probably show you guys that lunch and snacks and yeah, I'm just trying to wake up. I went to bed um, at a decent time. It was before 11, which is a decent time for me. And yeah, so I'm just getting my day started. Just wanted to come on and start off the vlog. I'm going to start this off fresh as a new vlog. I'll have to end the previous, the previous one at some point. Um, so today is just a regular Monday. So I'm going to go to work and pray for it to be over as soon as possible because I really don't feel like being bothered. Um, I'm having a breakout on my face. Just like, yeah, I don't know what's going on, but it is what it is. We're just going to roll with it and keep going. Uh, this week is Jada's homecoming week, so she's got a lot of, you know, little fun activities and stuff at school, and then her homecoming is Saturday. I still haven't showed y'all her dress. If I remember, I'll show it to you when I get home, but, um, yeah, that's it. So, let me get on down the street here. I got exactly 10 minutes to get here, park, and get on upstairs, so happy Monday to everybody. I hope have a great Monday. Welcome back to another vlog. Welcome back to your new favorite YouTuber. If you're new here, welcome. Thank you so much for stopping by. And if you've been here before, thank you so much for coming back. You know I appreciate you. I'll talk to you guys later. Have a good Monday. It's 12.30. I'm on my way to lunch. Finally, the morning took forever but it was pretty smooth it was just very long so I'm about to go and eat my lunch and I will show you guys what I'm eating as soon as I get down here see you in a minute <laughs>
steady now. I got y'all on my little trusty tripod. What's up, y'all? It is a totally new day. Of course, I am home from work and into something more comfortable. My pajamas. I'm getting ready to cook. So I want to just show you. I'm going to film it because I think this is a really good recipe. I love it. So I'm going to show you. I am doing cauliflower shrimp fried rice. You can buy your own head of cauliflower and grate it and then kind of cook it down to get the moisture out, but ain't nobody got time for that. So I'm going to use this and then I'm also going to show you guys the, I'm trying to think, where is it? I'm going to show you guys the um, seasonings that I use. Hold on now. I'm going to show you guys the seasonings that I use. And I think I'm going to cook enough of this for dinner tonight and for dinner tomorrow. So let's get cooking. I don't know where I need to be looking. Why is this light on? Anyway, so <clears throat> that's what I'm about to do. And I'm going to let y'all watch. Oh, I'm going to share, some, share something else with y'all. I just ordered this um, from Amazon. It just came in the mail. It is a prayer journal for women, 52 week scripture, devotional and guided prayer journal. Because not only am I on a path to better health with my weight loss, but my mind need a little work too. I don't know if y'all can relate. My mind need a little work too. So I'm going to be doing this. And this is a beautiful book. Um, they had a spiral version, but I didn't feel like I really needed a spiral version. But let me just show you. So, like this is your scripture, your reflection. You can write down um, whatever you want. And then the theme is different every week. And then I love this next page. So this is where you can really get into it. So this is, okay, Lord, thank you. Teach me, guide me, things on my heart, highlights, and then prayer request. This is so cute. This is so cute. So anyway, I just wanted to share this with you guys. I did get it on Amazon. And if I can remember, I will put the link down below. So let me put this away. Let me get my seasons and stuff out so I can get started. It is, it's 5.15 and um, I'm hungry. So let me get moving. Before I get started, if you decide to try this recipe, make sure you get the one with no sauce or seasoning because you're adding your own sauce and seasoning. I made a mistake before and got this um, that was seasoned already and it was way too salty because I didn't pay attention. So make sure no sauce or seasoning because you're going to add your own.
about to show y'all and I'm about to eat. I'm just having some water. Later on for dessert, I'm gonna have one of my Yasso uh, frozen yogurt bars and I think the flavor is birthday cake. So let me show you. Okay, here is the finished product. Cauliflower fried rice or shrimp cauliflower fried rice, however you wanna say it, a little sriracha on top. And that is dinner. Yum. Let me know down in the comments if you decide to make this. You can definitely look online for a recipe. I found this recipe online years ago and I've just been like tweaking it every time I make it, but super simple, quick, and so good. Yeah, that was so good. I don't even think I really chewed. I, I just swallowed it. I decided I'm not taking the rest for lunch tomorrow. I think I'm gonna do a turkey sandwich tomorrow for lunch because I don't want to cook tomorrow. So if I save the rest of this, then I have leftovers for dinner tomorrow. And to me, that sounds like a fabulous plan. So that's what I'm going to do. And I have quite a bit left, although I kind of want to eat a little more. But that's just the fat girl in me. We ain't going there today. She's not going to win. So let me show you what I got left. So this is what I have left. And this is quite a bit. So I'm going to have this for dinner tomorrow. And um, yeah. I'm gonna take a turkey sandwich for lunch tomorrow. This way I can come home. I don't have to worry about what I'm gonna eat. And if y'all curious to know what everybody else ate, this is orange chicken, uh, the Trader Joe's orange chicken and white rice. So that's what they had. So I'm gonna go ahead and wrap this. Well, I'm gonna let it cool, put the top on it, and then I'm gonna have this for dinner tomorrow. And then I'll have my turkey for lunch. Good morning, everybody. Happy Friday. I know y'all at an awkward angle, but bear with me. I have not really vlogged this week. Oh my God, I'm so glad it's Friday. I've been so exhausted and tired this week. And if y'all been watching here for a while, y'all know I'm a night owl. Like I be staying up late. I was done last night, like before nine o'clock. So, okay, y'all, I'm back. Anyway, um, yeah, it was like, nine something not even 9 30 and i was like uh yeah i'm about to shut it down i can't tell y'all last time i have gone to bed before 10 o'clock like it's been yeah i don't even remember but anywho today is friday thankfully i'm so glad i know i said that about three times but that's how excited i am so um it's jada's homecoming weekend She's excited about that. She has a hair appointment after work to after work, girl. When she get out of school to get the wig installed or whatever. I ordered her some shoes yesterday because she hadn't found any and I was scrolling through Amazon at work yesterday and I found her some like clear new like um, heels so we'll see how that works out hopefully they come today if not she has a, a pair that she can wear so we'll see and um that's about it i am on the way to work as usual and i'm probably gonna be a few minutes late but you know uh better late than never so i do have to have to <laughs> give me some um coffee today because it's necessary. I went to bed early but I'm still tired. Like I feel like I need a whole day of sleep. Y'all ever feel like that? Let me know down in the comments. Do you ever feel like you just need a day or two just to sleep? Just, just to get some rest. And I haven't even been doing anything so I take my vitamins and you guys know, you know, I've been eating pretty well although girl, I had some fried chicken this week and it was so good so so good um and I don't feel bad about it I'm still gonna weigh Saturday morning I had a good week last week um I lost five pounds last week but like I was really on it last week like when I'm really on it 
I be on it. Well, most of the times I'm not really on it. Like I'm halfway on and halfway off. So this week kind of been like a halfway on, halfway off thing. And I'm fine if I if I don't lose any weight this week, but I don't want to gain none either. So that fried chicken might have did me in, but I don't know. We'll see. So I'm pulling up here at work and um I'm going up here and give them all I got <laughs> on this this last day. Why is the parking lot crossed off or coned off? I don't know. But anywho, um, yeah, I'm going to go on ahead and give them all I got until 4 o'clock and then uh, it's a done deal. So, But I will talk to you guys later. Have an awesome Friday. What plans do you have this weekend? Let me know below. Oh, Jesus. The sun is shining bright. Everything is good. Y'all, it's the end of the week, and I don't have no energy to really bring lunch today, so I threw a bunch of crap in the bag, so let me show you. I just had a piece of honey maple turkey breast. I had two cheese sticks, <laughs> water, four of these crackers, and then I got this apple and cottage cheese, which I'm probably just going to eat the apple because I'm not really hungry because I had a um, venti pumpkin spice latte for breakfast, so... That's all I had. So I was just coming to show you my hodgepodge of um, stuff I threw in the bag for lunch today. That is it. All right, so y'all know I told y'all I was getting or trying to get more, um, a couple more pairs of shoes and clothes for work for the fall and winter. So I'm just gonna share with you guys quickly what I ordered, there's some more um, work shoes before I have to go pick Jada up. She went to um, get her hair done because homecoming is tomorrow. I, I think I said that early in the video. But let me share these with you right quick. I'm gonna turn the camera around. Give me one second. So these are the shoes that I got and they are super duper lightweight. Like it's like barely anything in my hand here. So these are the Franco Sarto. Y'all know I love that brand. And the patent leather loafer. Let me see if there's an actual name. Uh, name on here. Hold on. Okay, here we go. So this is the Car Carolyn Black. Carolyn, did I just say Carolyn? Girl, Carolyn Black is what it is. And this is in a size 11. I wear a 10 and a half. I can wear a 10, but it's kind of tight. So I usually get 10 and a half. These don't come in half sizes. So I got an 11. And it does, I tried one of them on and it does slip like off my heel when I walk because I wanted to be able to wear them, um, have the option to wear them like barefoot with just a little, um, what do you call that thing? Like a little slipper sock or whatever you call it. But I think I'm going to have to order those um, non-slip grip, whatever you call them, things that go here in the back of the shoe. So, but yeah, they are super cute and super lightweight. I love the detail on them. And this is something you can dress up or down for work or casual, dinner, whatever. And you can tell this is the shoe I tried on because I creased it already. But either way, and let me take this off. I want to see the tassels. All right, I just took the paper off and these are the tassels. These are so super cute. I love these. They're so just classic very nice and I love that they're not heavy. I can't stand a heavy shoe and I thought that it might would be heavy because you know it just looks like it would be a heavy shoe but this is like super lightweight and I love the stitching and the detail. So yeah my new pair of work shoes and I plan to get a lot of wear out of these. So stay tuned for that. I also got two pair um, of shoes from Target. Hold on, let me turn this around. All right, I was trying to find something to prop y'all up on, but I don't know where my mount is and I don't feel like looking for it. So yeah, 
Um, so those are the shoes that I got. And I got two pair of shoes from Target last weekend. They were having a, um, what were they having? I buy one, get one free. Buy one, get one half off. So I think I paid like 35 bucks for two pair of little casual um, work shoes. So um, maybe I'll show you those later because they're in the closet um, in the hallway. So I'm going to sit here for a few more minutes and wait for Jada to call me and let me know that she's ready so I can go pick her up. Um, I was going to go ahead and wash my hair tonight, but maybe I'll do it in the morning because I don't really feel like it. So yeah, and I got to figure out what we're going to eat. I made tacos last night and we got some left over, but like not enough for everybody like to eat and get full. So, and I don't plan on cooking tonight. So, I don't know. I ain't gonna hold y'all, but I will either talk to you guys later or tomorrow. Bye. Amazon just rung the doorbell when Jada's shoes came. So, let's take a look and see. Hopefully she liked them. If not, like I said, she got them other ones. Hold on, y'all. Oh, these, they're cute. Real cute. Okay. I'll let y'all know if she like them. All right, y'all can see them a little better here, but these are super cute and they were only like 35 bucks. So hopefully she likes them because Jada is a ticky one about shoes and clothes. And you know what? Let me stop talking about this dress. Let me go get the dress and show y'all. All right, y'all. This is the hair. Turn around, girl. <laughs> Turn around. I want to see the bag. Girl, don't do me. This is beautiful. She says she may straighten it, though. But I think it looks good curly. All right, y'all. Here is the dress. It is beautiful. And it fits amazing. And if anyone is interested, let me see if there's like a name or something on here. Um, I guess this is the name. Pre Primavera Couture.com. I don't know if that's the website where it came from or not. But this is the style number. I don't know if this is something that will still be in stock or not. But like I said, she tried this on um, last year for homecoming and she wanted to get it but we went with another dress and so this year it was on sale 50% off and her um godmother got it for her. but this is gorgeous look at the details on it and it's heavy as hell that's why I just threw it back down this dress is super heavy so it is very very well made I'm trying to see if it's like yeah, so it's got the little lining and everything in it, but it's gorgeous. It is gorgeous. So here is the dress, and she is absolutely obsessed with the dress, and it's super short. She told me for homecoming, that's what it's supposed to be. Everybody wears short dresses. I was like, oh, ma'am, okay, excuse me. So let me go put this back in her room. <laughs> ¶¶